The Edens from Charleston made the trip to Myrtle Beach for St. Patrick's Day weekend because they had heard there's a pretty good party going on. We're already having a good time, man. It's a wonderful time, actually. By the size of the crowd on the boardwalk, it looks like quite a few other visitors heard about the party, too. And that's exactly what oceanfront merchants were hoping for. Uh, this will be the third time we've done this exact celebration uh, on Ocean Boulevard, and the impact for downtown and for the city has been tremendous. Ocean Boulevard will close for live music on two stages and a festival that starts at noon Saturday. An alcohol-free kids area will also be available. In North Myrtle Beach, the 24th annual St. Pat's Day Parade gets underway at 9 a.m. with well over 100 floats and entries. That's followed by a festival featuring 175 vendors spread out over several streets. It's a record attendance for an event that's grown by, well, leprechauns and blarney. We put on a good show and everybody has a good time and they want to come back from year to year and make it their family tradition. The festivals in both cities have grown to the point that organizers say they're attracting big crowds from all over. We've got people from New York, Pennsylvania, Ohio that come in just for this event.